Hey, guitar lovers and bass lovers, it's back. This is the Waterstone 12 string bass. This thing is a monster. And it's not a monster of weight, size, and also tone. And you know, the reason I'm doing this today is because I recently used this on my song Lime. And I was talking to somebody, they were asking me, well, how does a 12 string sound when you use it in the track? Because you know, it's like in the on its own it's good, but what do you do with that extra octave strings that fight with the guitars or, or, or what's happening? So I used it on this track, Lime, and what we're going to do today is I'm just going to do a playthrough on it, and I'm going to drop out all the rhythm guitars, so it's just going to be everything uh, minus the rhythm guitars, so the only instrument you'll hear is this. I left the lead solo in there. <clears throat> And this is everything the same setting as I recorded the track on, so the mix is pretty much intact. The mastering is off, so that the timing works out. So let's just see what does a 12 string sound like in the track. Sometimes I, I'm like, oh, I could use a 12 string, but then I'm like, well, you know, I'll just do a normal bass, and then uh, maybe double it on a, a guitar, you know, up an octave. And I'm like, no, let's just dig in, lay, lay it down, and see what we got. And uh, and so let's see how it goes. This song is called The Lime, and you can check it out the full version right here. And uh, let's play some music. I'm not even going to fix clinkers or anything. I'm just going to do a run through here, lay down one. Eh, you know, if it's a if it's a killer pass, fine. If it's a if it's a if it's a little loose, that's all right because I've already finished the song and this is a, 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 a jam through. Let's see how it goes. So fine, like a line, so taut and sublime. It makes me plunker. I'm a sucker. Time after time, I won't lime. When I'm tequila. I want to see ya If I'm beer I want it near My testata Is it spinata If it's licking or squeezing Either way it's pleasing Living isn't life If there isn't any spice So fine Like a lie So and sublime It makes me pucker I'm a sucker Time after time I won't rhyme Like my guitar Rhyme's my star This one's twangy and That one's tangy so appealing to see it feeling. My fandom is a random since I got them up and slam them. Got a primal need, I need to find a way to feed. So fine, that's the gun. We won't have a good time If I go too long Without hearing that song I get that earth for that punch And make it taste Like a surge of a tidal wave That things be the waste If I don't get that luscious Love in my face I'm gonna seek it out Another place It's so fine Like a gun I'm a 
after time I won't lie Time after time I won't lie Time after time I won't lie That was it. I had a ton of fun jamming on it. And you know, the thing about it is it does take a little more work to get playing on this thing. Because, you know, you're pushing down three strings instead of one. Now, this thing's got great action. I uh, set it up. I made sure the neck was straight with actions is pretty much as good as we can get it. And, uh, you know, my little soft guitar player hands uh, say, okay, push harder. But, you know, once you get into like a, a vibe of it, you just have, you have to dig in a little bit more. But the secret is, what does it sound like like that? Because I was like, well, you know, what's it going to take away from the guitar track? Or how do you blend it in? What if you need more bass? But this, you know, the high stuff is poking out. So just take a listen to this. See how it sounds by itself. Go check out Lime, the finished mix in, the, in my video and see for yourself if it's serving the function of a bass and then something else extra or is it kind of missing the mark i think it's serving the function of the bass and uh and adding stuff in there hey uh if you like what you're hearing here subscribe like it share it and if you want to help me out you can buy something off of my uh band camp page and i will see you the next time because i've got a whole bunch of cool stuff here that i think i got a brand new uh, uh guitar that just came off of amazon i'm going to be reviewing i'm going to follow up on that the natasha guitar smart guitar and uh, we're gonna have some fun okay take you take it easy everybody and i will see y'all the next time rock on <laughs>